Fairy Terra Hyper Beam. Full power, let's see. Bang! Through the shields. Not even just breaking down the shields. That's the knockout. This Sylveon build rocks so strong. Gigits on hammer, we do not care. Welcome to another Dan Squared video, you Danimals. Today, we are going to be talking about solo terror raid builds for the Evolutions. The Evolutions are some of the most popular Pokemon in merchandise and a mainstay in the games. And today, we are going to turn those cute, lovable Pokemon into absolute raid clearing machines. We're going to go through each of the Evolutions and the order that they appear in the Pokedex, and we're going to give you a raid build to clear five and six star raids with every single Evolution. I am super excited to share these builds with you, so let's get right into our first Evolution and take a look at Vaporeon. Full builds for all the evolutions will be available in the description. Shout out to the VID, very important Danimal, Link, that shiny hunted every evolution that you see in this video. Vaporeon is our only build on the list that has a different Terra type than its original type. We use a Psychic Terra type to power up stored power. It can use Call Mine paired with Surf to take down raids that are weak to water type. It can also use Acid Armor and Call Mines to power up stored power for huge Psychic type damage. We use the Shell Bell for recovery so that every time we're dealing damage, we're also recovering some HP. Another move option is Chilling Water, which deals some water type damage and also lowers the target's attack. This build can hit for huge water and psychic type damage, making it one of the more versatile builds on the list. Keeping it in Kanto, next up is a Jolteon build. Jolteon can be a bit of a glass cannon, so we use our EV spread to give it some bulk so we can take some hits. It is the first of a handful of Fake Tears users on the list. Fake Tears is a super strong debuff for terror raids, lowering the special defense of the target by two stages. We use Call Mine once again for some additional firepower. Thunder Wave gives Jolteon and its teammates two boosts. It makes sure that the raid Pokemon is slower than Jolteon and its teammates teammates, and there's also a chance that the raid Pokemon is not going to be able to attack due to paralysis. Once the raid Pokemon is weakened due to fake tears, and Jolteon is powered up with Calm Mind, we can start swinging with Thunderbolt for huge damage. The extra bulk from the EVs goes a long way towards helping the survivability of this build, and it can hit for some serious damage, especially with the debuffs, the power-ups, and terrestrialization. Rounding out the Kanto trio of evolutions, we have a Flareon build for the people. Flareon is the first and one of two physical attacking evolution builds on the list. Just like Jolteon, Flareon tends to be a bit fragile, so we spent our EVs to make it bulkier as well. 99% of the time, Pokemon with the Guts ability will hold the Flame Orb to activate its effects. Flareon being a fire type cannot be affected with the burn status condition, so it cannot hold the Flame Orb. So to get that 50% damage boost from Guts, Flareon gets poisoned using the Toxic Orb. Wish gives Flareon some much needed recovery, especially when you're taking poison damage every turn in addition to getting hit by the raid Pokemon. The menacingly named Tickle softens damage from physical attacking raid Pokemon and softens up raid Pokemon for our physical attacking moves. Fire Fang may be a bit weak, but it's Flareon's second strongest fire type move behind Flare Blitz. Flare Blitz hits for massive damage, but the recoil will almost always knock out Flareon. Our recommendation is to use Fire Fang until you can Terrastalize and deal a finishing blow to the Terror Raid Pokemon. Recoil moves damage the user based on how much damage is done to the opponent. Terror Raid Pokemon have absurdly large amounts of HP, so when you use recoil moves, you're going to be taking hilariously large amounts and often knocking yourself out. Next up is the first of the Johto duo of evolutions, and that is Espeon. Following in the trend of glass cannon evolutions, Espeon tends to also be fragile, so we spent our EV spread once again to give Espeon some extra bulk and stay on the field in terror raids. Espeon is our second fake tears user of the list. Morning Sun provides the recovery for this build. Psychic Terrain activates Espeon's held item, the Psychic Seed, boosting its special defense. In addition to this, Psychic Terrain will also power up the Psychic type moves of Espeon and its allies. Thanks to Fake Tears and Psychic Terrain, Espeon hits for huge damage with Psychic. We use the Synchronize ability in this raid to inflict a raid Pokemon with any status conditions that it puts on Espeon. But you could also give your Espeon the Magic Bounce ability to reflect any status affecting moves back to the raid Pokemon. If you're enjoying this video so far, please consider dropping a like or a comment and make sure that you are subscribed with notifications on for more Dan Squared. Let's keep it in Johto and talk about our Umbreon build. Umbreon breaks the trend of fragile evolutions. This thing is naturally a tank, and for our EV spread, we made it even bulkier. Our Umbreon build uses Synchronize just like Espeon. To best utilize this build, you're going to want to swap out Light Screen and Reflect depending on what raid Pokemon you're facing. If you're facing a physical attacking Pokemon, give Umbreon Reflect to boost the defense of Umbreon and its allies. But if you're facing a special attacking Pokemon, Swap out Reflect for Light Screen to boost the special defense of Umbreon and its ally Pokemon. 
Umbreon is the third Fake Tears user on the list. In addition to softening the special defensive raid Pokemon with Fake Tears, Umbreon also has access to Screech to lower the raid Pokemon's defense. Snarl allows Umbreon to do a little bit of damage, but also it increases the special bulk of Umbreon and all of its teammates. We gave Umbreon the Light Clay item to make the duration of Reflected Light Screen go from 5 turns to 8 turns. This is the only support build that appears on this list, but it is an elite support build. This Umbreon can't deal enough damage to solo 6 or 7 star raids, but it's an elite teammate and it can solo 5 star raids because it allows its AI teammates to deal so much damage with Screech and Fake Tears. Let's kick it over to the Sinnoh region and take a look at our Leafeon build. This is our second and final physical attacking evolution build. Leafeon continues the trend of us favoring bulk for our evolution EV spreads. Leafeon starts every raid off with Leech Seed. This will chip away with a little damage at a time and provide some significant recovery thanks to the Big Root item. We gave our Leafeon the Big Root item to increase the damage that we restore with Leech Seed by 30%. We like to use Mudslap early in the raids so that the Terra Raid Pokemon is more likely to miss attacks against Leafeon and its allies. We use Swords Dance to power up Leaf Blade. Once we can Terrasilize, we hit for huge damage with Leaf Blade. Staying in Sinnoh, next up is Glaceon. We maxed out our Glaceon special attack EVs for some additional firepower. Snowscape is the key to this build. While it's snowing, Blizzard will not miss. The snowing weather condition also activates Glaceon's ability, Snow Cloak. Snow Cloak increases Glaceon's survivability because it makes it harder to hit with attacks. Glaceon is the fourth Fake Tears user on the list. It is the third Calm Mind user on the list. Once the snow is set up, Blizzard hits for massive damage and never misses. Glaceon is our third Shell Bell user on the list for that additional recovery. This build is very powerful and hard hitting thanks to the snowy weather condition. Last, but certainly not least, it's Kalos' own Sylveon. Much like Umbreon, Sylveon is naturally very bulky, in particular especially bulky, so we gave our Sylveon build defense EVs and then special attacking EVs for a damage boost. Pixelate turns normal type moves into fairy type moves and boosts them an additional 20%. Sylveon's fairy type moves get the normal same type attack boost of plus 50%, but its normal attacks get a stab of plus 70% thanks to Pixelate. Sylveon packs the ability shield item so it can keep Pixelate even when the Terra Raid Pokemon nullifies the stats and abilities affecting your side of the field. Sylveon is the fifth and final Fake Tears user on the list. Braining Kiss provides the recovery for this build. This Sylveon build, just like Money Mike, can use Hyper Voice to deal massive damage. But if Hyper Voice just isn't cutting it, Sylveon can use a pixelated Hyper Beam for insane damage. We suggest using Hyper Voice and Draining Kiss until you're Terrastalized, but once you're Terrastalized and ready to go for that knockout hit, let loose a pixelated Terrastalized Hyper Beam for insane damage. You could make Sylveon much more support oriented by using moves like Charm, Light Screen, or Reflect instead of Hyper Beam and Draining Kiss, and pack in a Shell Bell instead of the Ability Shield for recovery. If you like Sylveon and money making in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, make sure you check out our Sylveon build for AFK Money Farming the Academy Ace Tournament. That concludes our list of evolution builds for clear and five and six star terror raids. Let us know in the comments if you try any of these builds out or if you have any suggestions on how we can improve these builds. And one more time, shout out to Link for helping us put together this video. Thanks for shiny hunting the evolutions, putting them in coordinating Pokeballs, and helping us put together these builds. I laid awake for hours last night trying to figure out which evolution was my favorite in order to end this video. I think I have to stay loyal to my main man, Money Mike, and say that Sylveon is my favorite evolution. What is yours? Thanks for watching and hanging out with us. Make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe for more Dance Squared, and we will see you on the next video.